If you guys would like to win this free iPhone 8, all you guys have to do is follow these simple rules. All you guys have to do is subscribe to the channel, turn on channel notifications, leave a like on the video, and then comment down below saying you subscribed and you'll be entered to win at the end of the month. Yo, what is going on guys? It is District Training here bringing you guys this brand new video. Now today guys, we're going to be talking about how TK could be put in prison for life with the incident that just happened a few days ago at a Chick-fil-A. If you are a TK fan or just know anything about TK, I highly suggest you guys watch this video all the way through because there are some serious things that did go on in the past few days about him and this could lead to him having a really short rap career because he will be put in prison. Now before we get into the video, I got to give the channel shout out of the video. That is going to my boy Riley. Shout out to you man. Thank you so much for being active on the channel if you guys would like a channel shout out to start of my next video to help you gain subscribers you guys must go subscribe to Riley you guys must follow the rules or this thing just doesn't work because I just really want to help you guys gain subscribers so at the end of the video guys make sure you guys go to the description go subscribe to Riley that's the first step of getting yourself a channel shout out lastly leave a like on the video turn on my channel notifications and then comment down below saying you subscribed and subscribe to Riley and you'll be entered for tomorrow's video shout out now let's jump right into this guys so today we're gonna be going over some things that happened recently about TK. Now what happened could lead to TK being in prison for a very long time which will most likely be ending his very short rap career. Just to tell you guys a little bit about TK in case you don't know already, he's currently 17 years old, born June 16th in 2000. He's currently being held in an adult prison right now. I honestly don't know where but he is being held in an adult prison. TK is mostly known for his really hit song The Race which is a song about him running from the police after cutting his home arrest ankle bracelet off. Now TK has already been accused of so many crimes and now this one recently just came up which is a very huge deal because there are witnesses. Now let's get right into why TK could be facing life in prison and could possibly be ending his rap career. Now this is by no means a hate video towards TK. I'm actually a big fan of his music. I really love his song Mega Man which I actually prefer over the race which a lot of people don't but I'm actually I do like his music. So hopefully this does not happen to him because that would really suck to see somebody with this much talent go to jail. Now TK is currently already being held in a jail for allegedly murdering somebody but now another new case just came up that TK was apparently in the car when another murder happened. According to mysanantonio.com they said TK is a suspect in a fatal shooting at a San Antonio Chick-fil-A. Now usually that's not a spot where you'll see a crimes go down but in this area the article did say that a lot of crimes go down in this area especially at this Chick-fil-A which was very weird to read. But now in this article it said that there was witnesses at the time of the crime and a couple of them named TK as being one of the people in the car when it all happened. And because there are witnesses there's a really good chance that TK will be charged for the crime and will be put away for a very very long time. I'm not going to read the police report word for word because that's just kind of boring so I'm just going to sum it down for you guys because no one wants to be sitting here for a 15 minute video. So basically there was four people inside a black SUV and TK was one of the four, allegedly. Now the victim of this incident was apparently on top of the SUV while it was driving. People are saying that the people TK was with actually took something of the victims and the victim was trying to get it back so he was like holding on to the car while he was driving because he didn't want to get robbed. While he was holding on to the SUV while he was driving the passenger of the SUV actually came out of the window and pulled a gun out and then pulled the trigger to the victim. Now the person who pulled the trigger was actually not TK. It was a 23 year old named Alex. It wasn't TK but you're probably thinking if TK wasn't the one who pulled the trigger, why is he being arrested for the crime? Well, in some places, if you're with a group of people and someone in your group commits a crime as serious as murder, everybody in the group will be charged, even if you didn't do it. And because there are witnesses of this crime happening and they actually named TK as being one of them because he is a very, you know, popular person at the moment, it's easy to be recognized. Things are not, are definitely not looking good for TK at this current moment because we still don't know what's going to be happening with the case he's already facing right now. And then with this one on top of it, this could be ending TK's really short rap career, which absolutely blew off and released the song The Race. Now, honestly, I'm not going to sit here and pretend like I'm rooting for him to get out of prison because after making all these videos about TK, I kind of get like a feel of what he kind of was like growing up and stuff like that. 
sure he makes really good music, but guys, he actually wasn't really that good of a person. Although it's not really his fault for being a bad person because of the area he grew up in, he didn't really have a choice to, you know, go to a private school like most kids because he didn't have the, the financial income. And when you're a kid where, like, he came from, you're obviously going to be hanging out with people that are bad from a young age, so he kind of just was just a thing for him. It was his reality. There's nothing that he could have done about it because he didn't have the financial stuff, as I said, from earlier in the video. But anyways, guys, things are definitely not looking good for TK at this current current moment, but hopefully everything will work out. Now, let me know what you guys think of this down below in the comments. I want to know what you guys think. If you guys want to know anything else about TK, I've made tons of videos about him that has absolutely got great positive feedback because everything I say is facts. So if you guys want to go check those out, I will leave links down below in the description for you guys to go see. Also, guys, if you would like help growing your YouTube channel and want tips on how to do it or just how to do it, I provide a YouTube help service. So if you guys would like any more information about that, make sure you guys go follow me on Twitter down below. But anyways, guys, it's been District Trending. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. I'm out. See you later. Peace out.